Hi guys, welcome to another free running gaming video on the free running gaming YouTube uh, site. And yeah, so guys, as I said, we're bringing out different videos Titan 4, Black Ops Ghost, which is only Extinction or Chaos, and Black Ops 2, which is going to be the steps to greatness. But we're going to be getting straight into a Chaos mode. This is me and my Mind Tricks. Which is another player from the free running gaming and the free running snipers clan group, I would say. So, guys, we're gonna get straight into it now. The chaos mod is actually I find quite hard this year. Now, we can remember in Modern Warfare 3 there was a chaos mode, which was like a survival. It's exactly the same. You survive, you pick up guns, and beach. You have to keep up your times. So, if it's one, two, three, I'll go up and it'll show you in the middle of the screen, which is basically timing timing your number of points and then also there's a bar underneath which is kind of a green and red bar you have to keep that up from the from empty basically when it's empty it's finished we also have a timer from the top at the beginning and this is just giving us a guideline at the beginning to keep our times up so when you're in that time period you can repeatedly start again so if you go to zero you can start again getting your times back up getting your points back up but when the time the actual one minute or two minutes you give is gone it's finished you've got to keep that bar straight up to green no matter what you can go to yellow but then it's quite hard because you have to get that first shot in straight away so remember when you get the bar up you can get it by shooting picking up gun using equipment so remember you have for me I use vulture and I use my riot shield, riot shield, sorry. So each time I use them, the bar, the bar will go green. And also picking up the packages, what they chuck down. So any of them will actually help you. Oh, got one more thing, the traps as well. So any of them five will give you your bonus up. So remember guys, it's shooting, picking up guns, picking up packages, using your equipment, and using the traps. So any of those five combinations is a very good thing. So guys, on it you can have up to four players, but you know we're just playing it with two, and we get a decent score over 343, I think, times. So for a first or second try, it's actually quite good. We're improving and we're trying to get a lot higher. So you guys will be seeing probably one a week showing how we've improved and what's our strategies now. Because you know when you play in different games like this, survival is totally changing. Your survival mode changes. From just constantly attacking but maybe using different objectives around to try and get used to it uh the guns on here are, i would say they are quite good there are some really good guns on here which help quite a lot but um i haven't really found the best gun for me at the moment so i'm still trying all the different ones and remembering where they are so i will be showing you a load down as well where all the guns are so just in case that helps you in any of the ways but remember guys, it's from the first map, so the traps that you used to know on that one are kind of the same. They're in the same area, so just remember that from when you played the first extinction map into the chaos mode. We also have the perks on the top left hand corner. Now we have a total of, I think, 12, but without checking, I'm not 100% sure. And this will help you improve, so you'll have quick draw, you'll have um, extra life, which is a, a regeneration. Uh, your melee, melee, you're basically stabbing, will uh, be one hit kills for in for a certain time, and then, of course, it will come to two because stabbing will be just reckless after a while. You also can pick up your trophies as well. But back to the perks, they're actually really good. They actually help you quite a bit. The only one I'd rather see a lot more is the faster generation for your health, which is a I think should be a times two, so it's a quicker because it seems when the scorpions are shooting those stupid acid stuff it's quite hard to um, I don't know get used to it and get in the way so you also have gas mask as well which helps a lot but uh, the gu guys I don't really know what else to say it's a good game it's fun it's a lot harder as I said because it's aliens they're jumping around more where the soldiers are more a case of just standing there and shooting at you so you have to remember that in this, this area I will be coming up with some tips and tricks for it which will probably help you in different scenarios. I haven't tried 4 yet but I think 4 is going to be really chaotic on this map. I think it could do it and you could do it up into 2 teams. 
where uh, one team is at the top and then one team's at the bottom where you could divide it up because putting all the aliens together is going to be quite hard and quite difficult especially if you're in a confined area um, I'm trying to think what else is really fun on this um, I've tried all three maps I, I would say mm, I would say the second one's more fun just because it's kind of a bigger area and you get to have the chance to run around more so you don't get stuck uh, a few bad points of it I would say is that the um, areas that you get trapped quite a while quite a bit sorry so the trees in the certain directions are just in that way so you have to remember you have to turn around a bit more or go left or right a bit more to get out of that hole getting stuck in the area I would say so that's kind of a bad point and a second point is the fast regeneration and that needs to be a lot more and a lot quicker for it to help and I'll help you out a lot more because it's going to be difficult now guys I'm guessing there's going to be guys that are on there cheating already and so don't worry about the table but worry about what you think your objective is for this game is it just to get as many points or is it to get as how far you can actually get because it's kind of a two different area scenario so you can get as much points as you want the time element of how far you can go is a lot different so guys um check out our latest videos of course check out the one i just done from titanfall just expressing how i feel and how i don't feel about call of duty like the multiplayer of course the whole campaign it's always a great thing in the survival is always a good thing and also um bringing different videos out like watchdogs hopefully very very soon when as soon as it comes out one month from today actually the 25th so that should be great that's in the uk of course i don't know if it's in different areas but guys bringing out so much for more videos and i hope you guys enjoy it so guys like subscribe and check out free running snipers of course which is the sniper clan of the free running gaming group and also check out reef lawless great designer has great work coming out so guys check out us on facebook twitter and check out the other two channels as well on facebook and twitter guys thanks so much for watching i'll check you out later